Good morning. Bybury Systems, can I help you? Good morning, Geraldine. Good morning, Jenny. Your newspapers and the post. Thank you. Good morning, Jenny. Good weekend? Excellent, thank you. It is cold this morning. Mm, yes, very cold. Good morning, Geraldine. Good morning, Mr. Harris. Your newspaper and your post. Thank you very much. Good morning, Kate. Good morning, Jenny. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good morning, Jenny. Good morning, Don. Good morning. My name's Edward Green. I'm here to see Don Bradley. Ah, yes. One moment, please. Hello, Jenny. Edward Green is in reception. Please sit down. Thank you. Are you Edward Green? Yes. I'm Jenny Ross. How do you do? Hello. Pleased to meet you. Welcome to Bybury Systems. Thank you. I'm the head of administration in the marketing department. My boss is Don Bradley. Well, our boss is Don Bradley. Let me show you the department. This is the marketing department. This is my desk. Uh, that's Don's office. He's not here at the moment. This is your desk. Telephone, PC, in tray. Let me take your coat. Thanks. Over here is the stationery cupboard. Papers, files, pencils, etc. Help yourself to what you need. Here is the photocopier. And here is the fax machine. And this is the coffee machine. Would you like a cup of coffee? No, thanks. Kate, this is Edward Green. He's our new marketing executive. Yes, Edward. Hello. Welcome to Bybury Systems Marketing Department. Excuse me. Hello, Kate McKenna. What is Kate's job? She is head of sales. She is good. Where does she fit into the company structure? Here's the company structure. You see, Don is sales and marketing director and is on the board. Kate reports to Don. You are here and you report to Don. This is the boardroom. Here we have a range of products. Our toys. Come on, let's go to the R&D workshop. I'm sorry, R and D? <laughs> That's research and development. Ah, right. Thank you for calling. Goodbye. The managing director's office is on the first floor. Clive Harris. We call him Clive. Ah, this is Clive's secretary, Sally. 
Hello. And you have met Geraldine, our receptionist. Hi. So, this is the research and development department. This is Bob. And that's Pete. They are research assistants. And through here is Derek Jones' office. He has a team of six people. Derek, this is Edward Green. He's our new... Please. Oh, you're busy. Sorry. No. Please wait. There. Finished. Good. Do you like it? Um... What is it? It's a toy. It's a new electronic toy. It's very good. Edward Green, pleased to meet you. Derek Jones, welcome to Bybury Systems. Thank you. Edward Green starts today. He's the new marketing executive. Oh, yes. Is he good? I don't know. He's young, he's intelligent, he is well qualified, but of course, he has no experience. So, that's the existing product range. This is a very new product. In fact, this is a prototype. What is it? It's called Big Boss. Big Boss? What does it do? <laughs> Look, say, hello, Big Boss. Hello, Big Boss? No, no. Into the microphone. Hello, Big Boss. Try again. Hello, Big Boss. Hi, Edward. Welcome to Bybury Systems. What do you think, Don? I don't like this design. I agree. It's not good. I like this one. He looks angry. Yes. I think it's very funny. What do you think? What about glasses? That is very good. Good idea. Brilliant.
Hello, my name is Edward Green. I would like to speak to Mr. Smith, please. I am sorry, but Mr. Smith isn't available. Okay, I'll ring back. Does Mr. Smith have a direct line? I'm sorry, but the number is confidential. Okay, thank you. It's very difficult to speak to Mr. Smith. Yes, I know. Good morning. Are you YJ Advertising? Good morning. This is Don Bradley. Can I talk to Phil Watson, please? What company are you from, please? Bybury Systems. I'll put you through. Phil Watson's fine. Good morning. Can I talk to Phil, please? Can I ask who's calling, please? Don Bradley from Bybury Systems. Well, Mr. Bradley, I'm afraid Phil's not in the office at the moment. Can I take a message? Or would you like to ring him on his mobile phone? I'll try his mobile. Can I have the number, please? 0802 543 Double seven. Just let me check that. Zero eight zero two five four three double seven. That's it. Thanks. Hello, Phil Watson. Hello, Phil. This is Don Bradley. Hello, Don. Sorry to keep you waiting. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Can we meet? We have a new product, and I want you to see it. Hello, Mr. Smith's office. Hello, my name is Edward Green from Bybury Systems. I rang earlier. I would like to speak to Mr. Smith, please. I'm afraid Mr. Smith isn't in the office at the moment. Can I ask what it is about? It is very important. I represent Bybury Systems. We've got a new product, and I want Mr. Smith to see it. Please send the product specifications by mail, Mr. Green. I would like Mr. Smith to see the product and would like to talk to Mr. Smith direct. When is a good time to call? You could try ringing this afternoon. Thank you. Goodbye. Yes. Peter Hill. No, Peter Toyama. There is no one here called Peter Toyama. Is that extension 367? No. You've got the wrong number. This is 412. I'm sorry. Could you put me back to the switchboard? Yes, hang on. Hello, this is Edward Green. I rang earlier. I would like to speak to Mr. Smith, please. I'm afraid that Mr. Smith is in a meeting. Is he free later this afternoon? I don't think so. Mr. Smith is very busy at the moment. I'll ring again tomorrow. I'm afraid Mr. Smith isn't in the office tomorrow. Clive Harris? Clive, it's Kate. Hello, Kate. Are you busy? No. Why? I've got the sales report. And I have all the figures ready for the presentation to Mr. Sakai. Do you want to see them?
Good morning, Bybury Systems. How can I help you? Hello. My name is Sakai. I would like to speak to Mr. Harris, please. Please hold the line, Mr. Sakai. I'll put you through. Hello? Mr. Sakai is on the line. Put him through. Sorry, Kate. I must go. I have a very important call. I'll talk to you later. Hello, Mr. Sakai. Hello, Mr. Harris. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. How are you? I'm fine. I'm calling about our meeting. Yes. Hello, Bybury Systems. How can I help you? Could I ask who's calling, please? I'm afraid her extension is busy at the moment, Mr. Clark. Will you hold, or can I take a message? OK, that's fine. I'll ask her to call you back. Good night, Edward. Good night. I'm going to phone Mr. Smith's number once again. Good luck. It's six o'clock. Maybe Mr. Smith is still at work. Maybe his secretary isn't there. I don't think... Just wait. Ah, Mr. Smith. My name is Edward Green. Yes. You don't know me, but I work in Don Bradley's office at Bybury Systems. Yes. I spoke to your secretary today. Yes. You publish your catalogue this month, and we have an exciting new product. I have all the products I need. I would like you to have a word with Big Boss. I'm sorry. I'll put our new product on the line now. Hello, Mr. Smith. My name is Big Boss. I am 18 inches high. I am voice activated, and I want to be in your catalogue. So, Mr. Smith, when can we meet? I'm busy all next week. Maybe the week after. Talk to my secretary. You print your catalogue this month, don't you? Yes. Could you possibly see the product this week? It won't take long. OK. Be here Wednesday morning, 8 sharp. I'll give you 20 minutes. Thank you, Mr. Smith. I'll see you on Wednesday morning at 8 o'clock. Well done.
Good morning, Geraldine. Good morning, Mr. Harris. Jenny. Could you ring up Mr. Sakai's office in Japan? We need to set up a meeting. Not this week, but the meeting must be before November the 3rd. I'd like Kate, Don Bradley, and Derek to be there. Clive Harris. Clive, it's Derek. Hello, Derek. What can I do for you? Could you come down to the development workshop for a second? Derek, I'm busy. Come on. It'll take ten minutes. All right. I've got five minutes. I'm seeing Kate McKenna at eleven. Hello. Could I speak to Mr. Sakai's secretary? This is Jenny from Bybury Systems in the UK. Mr. Harris would like to arrange a meeting with Mr. Sakai. I wonder if you could check Mr. Sakai's European itinerary. Yes. Yes. Yes, I'll make sure he gets the message. All right. Goodbye. Mr. Harris, I've just had a call from Mr. Peter's secretary. I'm afraid he's going to be 15 minutes late for his appointment this afternoon. OK. That's no problem. Okay. Good morning, Vibury Systems. Well, Mr. Green can see you at 11 o'clock on Monday. Is that all right? No, I'm sorry. On Tuesday, he has a meeting in the morning. Is the afternoon possible? All right. Thank you. Hello, Bybury Systems. What do you think? We'll miss the launch date. No, it'll be on schedule. February the 15th? It will be ready for February the 15th. We must meet the deadline. Kate, have you got a minute? What's wrong, Jenny? I have a problem. I'm trying to arrange the meeting with Mr. Sakai. He is in the UK for these three days. The first, the second, and the third of November but he is only available on the 1st and the 2nd. That's the Monday and the Tuesday. Clive Harris is in Scotland on the Tuesday, and Don can't make Monday morning. And you and Derek are both in meetings on Monday afternoon. What am I to do? Set up an evening meeting? No. Mr. Sakai's secretary says he has dinner engagements on the 2nd and the 3rd. Monday evening. Mr. Sakai arrives at the airport at 9 o'clock on Monday morning. And it's a nine-hour flight. Monday evening is not a good time for the meeting. He'll be jet-lagged. Then Derek and I will have to change our arrangements. May I see my diary? Change our 10 o'clock meeting with Mr. Clark. Make it at half past eight on the 4th. You are giving a dinner party on the 4th. 8.30 a.m. Not 8.30 p.m. That's going to be a long day. Good morning. Hi, Edward. How's it going? It's going very well. You look very happy. 
I am happy. I met Mr. Smith this morning at 8.30. That's very good. And? Mr. Smith liked Big Boss. Good. But he didn't like the name. Why not? He says Big Boss isn't a good name. He wants to call it Tycoon Tim. But he thinks Big Boss will sell. Well done. It's your first marketing success. You know Mr. Sakai is coming at 10 o'clock, don't you, Jenny? Yes, I do. It's an important meeting, isn't it? And the slides are ready, aren't they? Yes, they are. And you have checked the monitor, haven't you? Yes, Kate, I have. Sorry, Jenny. It really is very important. Good morning. Hello, Don. Is everything ready for the big day? I think so. Don, I'm worried about the last part of the presentation. Can we talk? Thank you very much for collecting me. It's a pleasure. Don't mention it. Is your hotel OK? Yes, yeah, thanks. It's fine. It is good of you to visit us. Thank you for sparing the time. I know you have a busy itinerary. It's a pleasure, Mr. Harris. I enjoy coming to Britain. And I'm looking forward to my visit to Bybury Systems. It's kind of you to say so. We'll do our best to make your visit worthwhile. You're seeing Phil Watson at 12 o'clock about the display unit design. Do you understand the problem? No, I don't. These are the rough designs. Choosing the right color is very important. Sorry, could you explain what you mean? Well, we need different colors. Ah, do you mean stronger colors? Yes, I do. This display unit must make an impact. It's very important. It must look right for the launch. It must look exciting. I understand. Well, make sure Phil understands. Also, these pictures of Big Boss need to be bigger. So, we aren't a very big company, but I think we are very efficient. How many people do you employ? 
about 700 full time. But we take on casual staff when we need them. Would you like some more coffee, Mr. Sakai? No, thank you. And please call me Kazo. And you must call me Clive. So, shall we have a look around? That would be very nice. And then perhaps we could have some lunch. And then after lunch, some of my senior managers will make a presentation to you. Would you like to leave your coat and briefcase here? Thank you. And this is our sales and marketing department. I don't think you've met Kate McKenna. She is head of sales. How do you do? Kazo Sakai. Let me give you my card. Thank you. And this is Don Bradley. Hello, Mr. Sakai. We have spoken on the phone. Hello, Mr. Bradley. You're American. And what part of America are you from? Los Angeles, but I have lived in the UK for five years. I've I been... I'm sorry. No, please, after you. I've been to Los Angeles two or three times. It's an interesting city. Well, I hope we have a chance to talk again. Yes. You will be seeing Dawn at the presentation this afternoon. I look forward to that. Edward. Yes. Hi, Edward. Hello. Phil Watson. Good to meet you. Have you been waiting long? Uh, not really. Sorry, I was delayed. Shall we get straight down to business? Why not? Follow me. Derek. Let me introduce you to Mr. Sakai from Detmore Systems. Mr. Sakai, can I present Derek Jones? Derek is our development manager. It's very nice to meet you, Mr. Sakai. Hello, Mr. Jones. I'm sorry to interrupt your work. Not at all. I like meeting visitors. You're very welcome. Please make yourself at home. So, this is the development workshop. Most of our products start here, and this is our latest product, Big Boss. Ah, yes. Yes, we think Big Boss will be very successful. And what does he do? Say hello. Konnichiwa, Sakai-san. Vibri Systems, New Yokoso. Ah, he speaks Japanese. He also listens. And by changing the chip, he understands and speaks any language. How are you fixed for lunch? Thank you, but I have another engagement. Okay. Another time, maybe. So, you say you want stronger colors. What about this? I'm not sure about this one. Are you? No. Whew. 
Could we have these two colours? Yes, but those two colours together? Ah, right. So, what kind of food do you like? Italian? Or there is a very good French restaurant close to the office? Whatever you recommend. I like eating all kinds of food. Then let's go to the French restaurant. Uh, Geraldine, please confirm lunch for two at René's and cancel the other reservations. OK, Mr. Harris. Hello. I'm calling from Vibery Systems. I'd like to confirm our reservation for two people at 12.30, please. The name is Harris. Thanks a lot. Goodbye. By the way, are you free this evening? Yes, I am. My wife and I are going to the theatre this evening. Would you like to join us? That's very kind, but no thank you. I love going to the theatre, but travelling makes me very tired. Tonight I must sleep. Geraldine will be back for 1.45. I must tell you, Clive, Big Boss made me smile. Let's have a run through. We must get this right. First, we have the introductions and the agenda. Second, I talk about the background. Company growth, staffing levels, return on investment, turnover, and pre-tax profit. Third, Derek, you talk about the product range. Now, at this stage of the presentation, we want to give a broad company profile. Don't give too much detail about specific products. OK, Dom. I'll describe the range and say which products are successful. Good. Mr. Sakai may want to discuss certain products, so be ready for that. At the end of this section of the presentation, I will ask Mr. Sakai if he has any questions. We won't discuss research and development at this stage. That will come at the end. Then, Kate, you talk about major markets and sales strategy. Is everything ready? Everything is ready and rehearsed. Right. The product title goes here. Now, just remind me, is the product called Big Boss or The Big Boss? Big Boss. OK. These letters? Or these black letters? No, I don't like those letters. OK. These. Can they be larger? Yes, like this. It looks good like that. 
Excellent. It's very clear. It's easy to read. That's what I want. Again, welcome to Bybury Systems. We are very honored to have the opportunity of making this presentation to you, Mr. Sakai. In the next hour and a half, we hope to show that, one, Bybury Systems has the right product range for today's marketplace and ambitious plans for the future. Two, that our market share in Europe is growing at a steady rate. Three, that our marketing strategy in the US is very successful. And lastly, four, that we can be a major player in Far Eastern markets. And we're sure that we can be a major player in these markets. If you have any questions, please feel free to interrupt at any time. But first of all, some background information on Bybury Systems. As you know, the company was started over 40 years ago by Mr. Harris Sr. In those early days, the company's core business was model railways and cars. And here we have some copy that tells us what the product can do. Some toys talk, some toys listen, but Big Boss talks and listens to you. And here, and here are the pictures. They show Big Boss with the accessories. What do you think? The pictures are OK, but I don't like the copy. Why not? It's not exciting. It doesn't sell the product. Some toys talk, some toys listen. Big Boss talks and listens to you. It's not the way you say the words, it's the words themselves. They're not right. Some toys talk, some toys listen. No, no, I want new words. Words that give Big Boss status. Words that make him important. Let's move from the general to the specific. I'm going to talk about two of our products. Friendly Fish and Mad Monkey are two products that use the same mechanism. It is a simple mechanism But this diagram here shows how well the mechanism works with the design of the product. For instance, take a look. I don't like the slogan. No, it's not right. Every office needs a new boss. It's just not right. Any ideas? Some bosses are big. Some bosses are small. Big Boss is the best. No. So this slide here shows a total net income from the previous year. The blue line represents income from those products in the low volume niche market category. The red line represents products in the high volume low margin category. Excuse me, what does the dotted line represent? I'm sorry. This dotted line represents income from accessories and add-ons. Thank you. And why the sharp decrease in February? This is a combination of two things. First, seasonal factors. And second, the end of the product life cycle. OK, so it's not right. We'll get you some alternatives tomorrow or the day after. No. I think I've got it. The one boss your office needs. The one boss your office needs. <laughs> That's good. That's the slogan. Thank you for your very interesting presentation. I would like to tell you one or two things about our operation. As you know, 
We specialize in electronic games. We have a very large market share in the Far East. We manufacture computerized games for young children. Some games are for adults. This game, for example, is the number one bestseller in Japan. The office workers love it. We know the market responds well to any kind of high-tech executive toy. Big Boss can succeed in the same market. But there is one question I would like to ask. Is it possible to launch Big Boss before January 28th? January 28th? 